So I released a video yesterday that didn't go down very well. A lot of people hated on me for it. A lot of people said that they had unsubscribed because of the video that I made. Because apparently, it's only acceptable to criticise people who are already being criticised. Society. Fan flipping -tastic. I do not regret making that video whatsoever. I do not care how much hate it got. I made the video criticizing PewDiePie's latest music video, uh, saying congratulations to T-Series, simply because I thought that he said some quite, you know, bad things about T-Series, things that weren't true, and I just felt like the dynamic of the song wasn't particularly good. I didn't think it was a very good reflection on PewDiePie as a person. I was genuinely annoyed at PewDiePie, I just think that the music video was, like, made in a way that I thought was a little bit too slanderous towards T-Series almost, and way too negative. I don't know, I think it just blown everything out of proportion and I made a video on it and a lot of people got triggered at that. I think people just read the title, they were like, oh my god, Cameron does not support PewDiePie, unsubbed. If you're honestly like that, if you have that mindset, if you literally will unsubscribe from me for just criticizing someone who you like, just flipping leave my channel, like, I don't care if you're subscribed, like, I don't care if you unsub, I've been losing subs for ages but also gaining subs for ages. It balances out, I can afford to lose them, okay? Today we'll be taking a look at this subreddit. The subreddit is instant regret. Have you ever had a moment where you do something and you instantly regret it? Taking business at A-level? <laughs> Breaking up with a girlfriend. Guys, I relate with this topic 100%. <laughs> Am I a failure, guys? I want to firstly clarify that the thumbnail and title is a joke. I don't actually think I'm a failure. Uh, don't worry about it. And I'm not actually depressed. Like, I have had issues with depression in the past, but a lot of people just assume that I'm literally this sad troll making videos. Guys, I'm in a good mood filming this video. I love making videos. Don't think I've got that depressed. It just gets views. Give me a break. So without further ado, let's take a look at some of these memes. Smash like on this video if you enjoyed it. Subscribe to the channel if you're new today. First post. Posting on a flaming chair for a cool photo. Now, this is interesting just because that's not even a cool photo. I'm not even gonna lie, like, it's just kind of daft, really, and I don't know how they managed it. I doubt that this is from the same scene, just because of how, like, much lower quality this image is. Like, wh why would it be in such a worse res? Like, that doesn't even make sense at all. But yeah, that, that's a pretty big epic fail. I'm not even gonna lie. I mean, I can't relate with it. I've never tried to set a chair alight and tried to take a photo sitting in the goddamn sea. That's not something I've tried to do. But, like, I, I see why, you know, it is a failure. You could have died, man. You could have burnt and been eaten because you would have been cocked up. Playing with knives. Playing with knives. Oh my god, she actually threw the goddamn knife. In the TV. I feel like the least funny reaction channel right now. Literally just stating the obvious. Look at that. She threw that knife. Because she was playing with it. Why has she got four knives? Like, what the hell? At least the TV still works, to be fair. That's pretty much light new condition if you want to sell it on goddamn eBay. So it's alright. What's this? She underestimated the power of her eyebrow wax. Something I've learned is never ever criticize a girl's eyebrows. Just say they're really nice. All the time. Even if they look like crap. Even if they're little lines. Just say yeah, they look great. You'll make their day. Do not say they look bad. If you say that a girl's eyebrows look bad. Oh my god. You're in big trouble. She's just going to cry. She's going to be so sad. So don't do it. So even though she has no eyebrows. Say that she has nice eyebrows. That'll definitely go down a tree. She's still got a bit of an eyebrow. What's her reaction like? Jesus Christ. Well, I feel kind of bad for her. I'm not even going to lie. You know, she's just trying to look good, you know. She's just putting effort into trying to look good and she just messed it up. I feel bad for her. Like, eyebrows are weird because if you don't touch your eyebrows, they seem to look better than if you tried to tamper with them. That's something I know. First-hand experience. I've never altered my eyebrows and they're sexy as hell. Oh, my God. God, they're so nice. Oh, yes. Big star one, two, threes. Thick eyebrows look horrible, so... Maybe I don't know what I'm talking about. Lighting up a grill like a boss. Hmm. <laughs> That's his fault, though. What did he expect to happen? Like... He shouldn't have worried too much because plastic uh, doesn't conduct heat that badly so he could have just held it and it would have just stopped 
Definitely true. Definitely true, guys. I want to take chemistry at degree level. As you guys can tell, my chemistry knowledge is at peak. What's this? That reaction says it all. I don't like dog memes. I think people, like, personify dogs way too much. Like, yeah, they have emotions, but they're not like people. Like, I don't find it that funny. I don't know why. If someone says, oh, this dog is forever alone, it looks really sad. I'm just thinking to myself, it's not actually sad. You're personifying it. So, like, I just, I just don't get it. Trying to outrun a wave. How does that have 7,000 upvotes? That's the deadest meme I've ever seen. It's as dead as my YouTube channel. Like my YouTube channel's pretty dead. When you won't take no for an answer, I can relate with this. Uh, for no reason. P promise. Oh, so he's just drinking some lemon juice. Wow. No, I'm actually not gonna lie. Lemon juice, concentrated lemon juice, low-key banks. Yeah, I know no one's tried it, but I actually really like lemon juice. I, I have a weird taste for things. I'm not even going to lie. But no, nah, this kid, he started to enjoy it. He started drinking it and he was repulsed. But then he's like, you know what? This is quite... N Never mind then. What am I chatting? <laughs> nah, it's all right. Trying to show off. She could have just taken her clothes off, to be honest. What's this? When she spits it out, it's clear. Look at this. It's clear. What the fuck? This woman is crazy. She literally took a yellow solution in the mouth. Not urine. But like, she spat it out and it's clear. Oh, so ones that have a full 3D out of shell. Okay. Okay, that's good. All of the other ones have colors. Rope swing goes wrong. She's a bit of a tubby lady, so I, I wonder what's going to happen. Oh, never mind. I expected the whole rope just to flip in. <laughs> oh, it just hits plastic defamation. <laughs> Dead. Well, that's what I expected to happen because I thought that, you know, reincarnation of a hippo. I thought it was going to knock it down. Time to carjack this oncoming vehicle. Okay, they get out of the car with a gun. This is, wow. What's the issue? What even happened? They didn't even get out of the car. They just all backed away. Flipping egg. Russian road rage. Okay, this is great. Guess that was BMW. These are some flipping expensive cars. <laughs> what the flip? I expected the window to go down and my man go That's not what happened. He just had a gun out. Man! The last meme we're going to look at is dad teaching son how to box. I wish my dad taught me how to box because I can't box. But I love books and god dang it. So we've got Floyd Mayweather Sr. I think here. We've got Floyd Mayweather Jr. if I'm correct. Ha, my favorite, my favorite move in boxing. The old slap. <laughs> Don't look at me like that, I'll hold your shit up. Like this, you know, put your dukes up. Oh. You know? So lesson number two, it's gonna be, see what I'm saying? Hold your Yes, another up. slap. Definitely like not this. an illegal move. Like this here, son. Hold them up like this here. You know, you don't want nobody all off in your shit. So now, lesson number two. Find you open space to land a shot on your opponent. You know what I'm saying? You gotta find you somewhere for you to get in. You know? Mm -hmm. So, okay, let's go. Let's go. <clears throat> pop, pop, you motherfucker! You pop. You you mother <laughs> That's actually <laughs> sick. What the hell? <laughs> that was so funny. Anyway, guys, I'm going to end this video here. Hopefully, you enjoyed me taking a look at the instant regret subreddit. If you enjoyed this video, smash like, subscribe to the channel if you're new today, and I'll be seeing you guys later. Goodbye.